Hello YouTube, this is uh, King Job here, and um, if you notice it says DSL instead of Robot Arena, I downloaded the game, I might do a video on how to download it if I get enough views, so right now it's just a tutorial on how to build and the battle. First, what you want to do is make a team. Click on the empty space. Either click circle and you can expand it, or click on rectangle. You can expand length and width. I'm gonna go a rectangle for now, and probably next video I'll do a circle. Oh, let's make it a bit bigger. That's fine. Okay, so you got your chassis here. First, what you want to do is click on motors. Um, go to either this one, this one, or this one. I'm going to go with the JX burst motor. Put it in the bot. Put an extender on it. about 40, no, about 20, and this doesn't really matter what's on the end of your flipper, uh, so I'm going to go with the emergency flipper, then adjust it, There you have your flipper. So I'll put range of motion start about right there. Range of motion ends about right there. Okay, and then I'm going to put the chip in so I can show you guys what it's going to do. About right there. Go to controls pull down the button. I don't care which button you put in. It doesn't really matter. I'm just going to use space. And then to get the flipper to move, you have to click on the engine, go to fire, and just push the space bar. Now I'm going to get to the motors of the wheels. Um, if you have enough space, I prefer, prefer these, the, I prefer those, the perm, the perms 132, but for this video, I'm just going to use the, I'm just going to use, um, these since this is a lightweight bot. You have a choice to put them on the outside or in the inside. I'm going to go with the two, I mean, yeah, in the inside. Uh, with this video, I'm just going to go with these wheels because they're the smallest. So just do that for four of them.
maybe in some other videos I'll do an advanced building robot, but I don't know because that takes so long. Uh, Okay, now that you have your four wheels, go to controller, bring down two analogs. Um, I use up and up, down, and arrow, up and down arrow, bring down another one, use the click on, do the right and the left, click on one. Okay, this is the difficult part. Put two of them on spin clockwise, and then the and then the other two on spin counterclockwise and then just do the same thing for the negative axis but backwards see alright and now I'm gonna test it See. Now the left and right is sort of tricky, but with the right all you do is go and make each wheel spin whatever way you want at the same time. So you go and set this one spin clockwise, set this one spin clockwise, right there, set this one spin clockwise, set this one spin clockwise, and do the same thing with the negatives. Okay, so now you got this. Okay, so now um, if you want, you can put a motor in the back. And put like a spike or something back there. Like this. Here I'll show you. Or you could put a blade or something. See? But I'm going to go with the spike. Going to go with the pointy tip. And all you do with that is go back, bring down another button. I'm going to go with Z. Again, you can pick any button off your keyboard. Do the same thing. Spin counterclockwise or clockwise. And then just push Z. And you see it's spinning. And you got that. You got that. Got this. Got that. Got that. Got that. Okay, so now um, I really don't like this white paint job. So we're going to go and uh, switch it up a bit. Let's see, surface layer. I'm going to go with green. Edge lines, I guess like that, yeah. And then this is pretty cool. Uh, I'm going to go... This one... Okay. Now we're going to go test it. Uh-oh. Uh, the wheels might be too small here, so we're going to have to fix that. Take these out. And put in Vlad's wheel. There we go. And don't worry, the controls will still be there so you won't have to set them again. As long as you don't delete the motor. Okay, now. And to put more um, power to your weapons, 
go to power go to the the three battery choice and click the icon shift it around put some you have to put the batteries right next to the weapon that you want most powerful so I'm gonna go with the flipper here and just lay it down right next to it and it'll be a little bit more stronger than normal if you figure out how to put it down see a little bit more stronger now I'm gonna add one more there we go alright now to add the small ant batteries that's a lot stronger add it to the wheels too there we go that there that there and put this there now your wheels the flipper and your spike is a lot stronger let's see if I put big enough wheel yep see alright now time for the battle test first I'm gonna go here profile picture set it to where we start like this bot name name it whatever you want um... toxic flipper okay take a picture there we go okay now back back menu exhibition uh, I'm gonna go one on one let's go battle bots no hazards users oh yeah these are the bots that come with the download they're okay bots they're not as good as what you make what you make so I recommend you go and make your own bots here's the bot that we made bring up the computer bot they have all of these I'm gonna go against the flip test dummy put time on unlimited and start hold on got to switch camera here there we go Let's see if I can hit him with this spike. Okay, so thanks for watching YouTube and uh, subscribe.